Hi, my name is Paulie Z, and I am the founder and CEO of the David Z Foundation, which is a nonprofit organization that raises money for music education and programming for children around the world in memory of my brother, David Z. Our mission is to transform lives through the magic of music. Are you ready to rock? Yeah! It's go time. Now, what does that mean? It sounds cool, but what exactly does it mean and what exactly do we do? I'm gonna answer that for you in this video, but first let me take you back just a little bit to the roots of all of this. David and I were brothers that were raised in Brooklyn, New York from a very early age. We always wanted to be rock stars. Uh, you know, we were making guitars out of cardboard and putting on concerts for our parents. But one thing we didn't realize is that we also loved education. We had a natural gift for working with young children. Something we didn't realize till later on in life when we started doing that stuff, just as a way to make money. This was our purpose in life, not just to be rock musicians, but to also work with kids and to be educators. So we focused our lives around that. We dedicated ourselves to rock and roll and education. And that became our brand, that became our identity. We started going into schools and actually combining the two by working with students that were having trouble with academics and writing these really cool rock pop songs about the academic subjects that they were struggling with. And the results were incredible. It was really magical because all of a sudden these kids were starting to learn these subjects that they couldn't normally remember or a process, but through the music, the melody, the lyrics, they were all of a sudden excelling. Right away we realized, okay, there's something here. There's a magic to this combination of music, rock and roll, and education. At the time, in 2011, I started a nonprofit organization that raised money for songwriting programs where we would write songs with kids about these academic subjects. The students write the song and create the video. I see firsthand the difference when you learn something through melody or through art. I went to art school and everything I did, I was a very good student, but um, I attribute that mostly to my ability to put things to melody or to visual um, association. It was like um, a good experience since we could teach other kids how to do rounding if they have trouble with it. It was amazing. We did it for a few years, but I moved from New York to LA and I stopped the nonprofit for a while. In 2017, my brother was killed in a very tragic car accident and that changed my life forever as you can imagine. State troopers say a tractor trailer hit an RV that had pulled over to fix a flat tire. The bassist for rock band Adrenaline Mob died in the crash. The band was on the way to St. Pete for a show. I had a lot of emotions that I never felt before, and I didn't know what to do with these emotions, and music saved me, like it always has, and it was always there for me, and I realized that how many kids are out there that have the same emotions, you know, are struggling in some part of their life where music could save them as well. And that's when I just realized, you know what, I have to restart this nonprofit. I have to get back into that work. And, and I resurrected the 501c3 and I changed the name to the David Z Foundation. And that's how this all started. During the pandemic, when I had no work, I said, you know what, I'm going to go back into, into the philanthropic work that I was doing. But now I had an, a more focused purpose, which was, to continue the legacy of my brother and what he and I were trying to do with our lives. Since then, we've done some amazing, amazing things. And I'm very proud to say we have an incredible team, a board of directors, members of our committee, rock stars that have been supporting us. This is Brett Michaels. David, you are missed every single day. Hey everybody, it's me, D. Snyder. The David Z Fund will keep music alive. Teachers, parents, just an incredible network of people that believe in the same thing that we believe, which is the magic of music to empower young people to be the best they can be. What we're about is using music as a vehicle, whether it's academic learning, whether it's youth mental health, or whether it's even to help prepare young aspiring artists to have a successful career in the music business. Music for us is a vehicle for that. It's the center of a more holistic approach to life, to being a well-rounded, healthy human being. Music to me is more than just the notes. 
it's a way of life. And that's what we try to do here at the David Z Foundation. We use the music to work with these kids in a more holistic way. We have multiple programs that we run. The three flagship programs that we have are the Medley Music Program, the Music Mentor Program, and the Modern Musician Program. The Medley Music Program is a program where we write an original song with a group of kids. Could be 10, could be 15, could be 30, could be 100. But we write a song about something that's either academic or socially conscious like pollution, anti-bullying. We write the song with the kids, we record it professionally, and then we create a music video and that gets posted on YouTube. They're part of the whole creative process. The lyrics, the melody, choreographing dance moves, storyboarding, and at the end they have a product that they saw to fruition from the beginning to the end. It's a very empowering process for them. Our music mentor program is similar to the medley music in the sense that we do write a song, record it, make the music video, but this is a one-on-one -on -one type uh, situation where we're working with a student as part of our youth mental health initiative to help manage emotions that maybe are very difficult to manage. There are kids that have either behavioral challenges, emotional challenges, and they don't know what to do with these feelings. And music is an incredible vehicle, healthy and productive vehicle to managing these emotions. So we show them how to take what they're feeling, put it into lyric, put it into melody, create a song, record that song, make the video. You have a final product that you can be proud of while processing all these very complex emotions that maybe they wouldn't normally know how to deal with. Then we have the Modern Musician Program, which is basically like your typical rock band, where you have musicians who are in a band and they're learning covers and they perform at the end of the year. But the difference between this program and most other programs is that we have a workshop that we created that prepares these kids for the music industry, for being a professional in the industry, because we teach them the basics of what the music industry is about. For example, what is a royalty? What is publishing? What does an A&R person do? How does a musician even make money? It's not the same now like it was in the 70s, right? It changes. So we take them from the 50s all the way to modern times and show them how the industry has changed and evolved and who these players are, what are these terms, what do they mean? And they get a broad stroke education to what the music industry is so that they're much more prepared when they enter it. We also have our scholarship program where we offer grants to families that need a little financial help, whether it's for private lessons or for instruments. There are a lot of families out there that we want to help and not let money be an obstacle for their kids to be able to have an education in music. We team up with schools and, and districts and find those families that can use help and literally just write the check and send it out and help them that way. These programs are part of the bigger initiative, which is to transform lives through the magic of music. That's what we're trying to do here. That's what we're passionate about. Our main focus is finding underserved neighborhoods and underprivileged children that normally would not have access to quality music programming and education. And what we've been doing recently is we've been able to expand internationally. So now not only running programs in the United States, like New York and LA and Pennsylvania, we are in the Chicago school system now, but we've been able to run programs in Cape Town, South Africa, in Buenos Aires, Argentina, Hong Kong. We're going to Israel and Spain. We've got schools on the waiting list around the world. There is a need, we know there's a need, and the impact is there. We just need to get it out. We need to just keep growing this thing and in our own little way, change the world. This is how we're gonna do it. And together, we can do that. So if you believe in that, if this resonates with you in any way, I encourage you to join the movement. Make a contribution, a donation, watch some of our videos and like them, volunteer, sponsor events, tell your friends about it, whatever it is. Just get involved and help us spread the message. Help us bring the magic of music to as many kids around the world as we can. If you want to find out more about the David Z Foundation, please visit us at davidzfoundation.org, our social media, and get involved because that's what it's all about at the end of the day, changing lives through the magic of music. Thank you so much.